5th. It's a Tuesday. Um, today, I'm not really going to be focused on any Instacarts or DoorDashes. I probably won't even turn those on today. Right now, we have two incentives going on. I have one here for uh, Uber. It's complete five rides, get $100. Complete 10 rides and get um, $200. I think it's an additional $200, which is cool. Maybe it'll get me to give more rides. And then second incentive is this one here. It's a spark incentive. If I complete 12 trips within the next two days, they'll give me an additional 60 bucks. So today, right now, I'm about to turn my Uber app on. All the kids are in school, baby's dropped off to a babysitter, so let's get this going and see. I'm a little nervous, I do not like doing, doing rides, but we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll go out to like a better area with, you know, less crime rate, I should say. But um, I'll let you guys know how I'm going with that. All right, you guys, so I just did two uh, Uber drives. They weren't paying much, but they were going like little trips, like two miles here, a mile there. I need three more Uber trips until I can get um, my $100 from that. I also did my shop and pay orders for yesterday. I finished them and I didn't get my money for that. So I'm gonna have to like see what that's all about. But um, I'm not getting anything on Spark, but we're gonna see um, if I can get another Uber drive. All right, you guys, so I'm on hold right now with Uber support um, to see about my promotional pay for yesterday. I just picked up my third um, Uber order. It's literally going like less than a mile from the pickup, so. Just doing the quick, simple, easy ones. I'm not doing any airports. I'm not doing anything of, like that because I do have like my wagon and I took my car seat base out and I have my big banana box that I use to take my spark orders up to the door in the trunk. So I don't really have room for people to put luggage in. So I'm gonna tr try to avoid that. But I will say that my last two riders that I got were very nice. They were very respectful. They were not creepy at all. So it's going good. I might start doing this a little bit more um, just to, you know, get a feel for it since I have this in my arsenal of apps to do. I just, having the people in my car, it's weird. Maybe I'll only do it when there's promotions going on. But I'm going to go ahead and head over to pick this. I think it's a girl. I'm not sure if it's a, I don't know her name. Farah? I don't know. But I'm trying to figure out this promotional pay because I did those five shop and pay orders and I promise you I did not do all of those orders just for it to not give me my money. I don't like that. <laughs> but I'll let you guys know if I get another one after this or not. I hope I do. I just after this would just need two more and then I can get my $100 and hopefully be done for the day. So I just got off the phone with Uber support and they are trying to tell me that I never had that promotion which is weird seeing that uh, in my last video, I literally posted it, here it is again. Um, so I don't know, hopefully they give me my money. I'll be a little irritated if they do not because I would have never taken those shop and pays um, that were going like far when I was super tired and just wanted to go home for the night. But whatever, right? I mean, you win some, you lose some can't get mad at it but I'm three minutes away from picking up this next customer that'll leave us two more that we need to do and hopefully I get the promotion for this one you know you never know I guess now with uber I've never really done promotions for them all right guys we just filled up on some gas make sure that if you are doing gig work that you do use upside especially if you do instacart as well I've been, you know, I fill up about every three days. I put about $40 in from 40 to 50. I try to fill up when I'm at half a tank, but sometimes I just don't feel like it. And I end up just putting a whole bunch to fill up my tank, but either way, it's gonna go in there regardless. But um, you use the Upside app. Since I'm a diamond uh, shopper on Instacart, I get like an additional 10 cents off of what Upside is offering. So right now I have like $26 in cash back for um, Upside. 
So I'm planning on using that for like Christmas shopping and stuff. I just got an order that I cannot pass up. It's a Perkins order. $10, two miles, and I'm gonna go ahead and take that just to kind of maximize my earnings. I've been declining a lot of kind of good orders for food just because I was trying to focus on doing the uh, driving orders. But So I'm gonna go ahead and pick this Perkins up, get it in the hot bag, get it to the customer, and see what shoots out next if I can get out of this um, gas station without getting my car wrecked. So I have the order of my car. It's kind of a big one and it's not going to fit in my hot bag, which is a problem. I seen at Sam's Club for $8. They have big like hot bags and I'm thinking about going and picking some of those up or at least one of them. So when I have these big orders like this, I can easily just make sure that it's in a hot bag. Um, the customer is five minutes away, 1.8 miles, not a bad order at all. And it does have potential for a hidden tip because this is a big order. There's like two bags, two coffees, you know. We can only hope for the best, right? Since Uber didn't want to give me my $30 for my shop and pay orders. All right, so drop that one off. It was really nice because she actually came to the car. She's like, I'm just saving you a trip. Got her stuff, thanked me. Everything was cool. Then we got ourselves another Uber. It's going more towards my house. I'm 11 minutes away from him, but the drop off is like two miles. And I'd rather drive further to go pick them up for them to only be in my car for like five minutes than have a close pickup and them in my car for 10 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick up, it's Tyrone, but it's spelled T-I-Y-O-R-N-E. So we're gonna go pick him up, drop him off, and maybe we could get our last one to make our hundred dollars so that'll put us at around maybe a hundred and forty dollars for the day and i might take the rest of the day off and just all right got him all dropped off he was going to college um to and take a couple classes become a basketball player i'm like hey you never know maybe i'll see you on tv in a couple of years what's this but yeah got him all dropped off I just need one more uber order and then we're good and I can go, I don't know, man, I'll try out some Sparks. They're really not giving me anything and like, I know that I'm trying to go for an incentive right now, but I still have standards. I'm sorry, I'm not taking anything that miles to money ratio does not make sense. I will not do a $7 for 14 miles. I'm not doing a 32 miles for $32, 17 people, not doing it. So they're gonna have to send me a good order. I don't know if I'm going to make this incentive or not. It'll be nice if I do, but if I don't, I'm still getting $100 from Uber. So, oh, here's a good one. $10.57. My last Uber order. Just got it. We're going to um, pick her up, drop her off, and go figure something else out. Maybe I'll do some more Uber since I need $10 for that extra $200. I'm actually not... Um, opposed to it right now. I'm doing right, okay, so I got that last one dropped off. It was a little bit, um, so she got into the car and she asked me if I would be able to take her back. She was going to pick up an edible arrangement. I know you're not supposed to, but she was really nice, so I did it. She tipped me an extra $30 and I got my promotion, so now my total for today is $181 and I've been out for, I got out around $11.30. So I would say that's pretty good money. I could take the rest of the day off if I wanted to. I'm probably not though, but we will see. Thank you guys so much for coming on this ride along with me. I know that I didn't show you any um, of the customers that I picked up. I just don't know how I feel about that. Um, you know, showing their faces and things like that without their, well, I guess you wouldn't really see their face, but regardless of the fact, it's just a little iffy with that, seeing that they're, you know, my riders but um pretty soon i am going to be getting like uh, something that i can put my gopro on so when i go on my instacart orders and my walmart spark shopping orders and the uber orders and the doordash orders i can take you guys along with me with that i think it'll be really cool to see a point of view on how things are done instead of just me hopping back in the car all right guys this is done you know whatever so hopefully um i'll be able to get all that in Again, thank you guys so much. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys with another video really soon.